Hi everyone! In this video, we will identify type 1 and type 2 errors for a hypothesis test. A nutrition program is introduced to improve the health outcomes of patients with diabetes. The null hypothesis is that the program does not change average blood sugar levels, while the alternative hypothesis is that it lowers average blood sugar levels. What is the type 2 error in this case? To help remind me what type 1 and type 2 errors are, I like to write them down, type 1 and type 2. Then I like to say the phrase true or false. We don't say false or true, so we go in the same order as type 1 and type 2 and say true or false, and this helps me remember that the null hypothesis for a type 1 error is true and that the null hypothesis for a type 2 error is false. And because we are dealing with an error, a type 1 error is when the null hypothesis is true and we don't accept it as such. So we reject the null hypothesis. A type 2 error is when the null hypothesis is false, but we fail to reject it. We were given the null hypothesis is that the program does not change average blood sugar levels because a type 2 error falsely fails to reject the null hypothesis, uh, a type 2 error for this is that we incorrectly believe that the program does not change average blood sugar levels. when it really does. We have now identified the type 2 error for this hypothesis test and we're all done.